DPF filters harmful particles created when diesel burns. They are fitted to all diesel vehicles manufactured after 2009. The particles are trapped in the DPF and collect there as soot. Every 300 miles or so, the DPF will regenerate by superheating the filter to burn off the soot. Much of the soot is expelled through the exhaust as finer particles of ash. This clears the soot, but some residual ash remains in the filter. Each time regeneration occurs, more ash builds in the DPF. At around 33,000 miles, ash can account for up to 50% of the material blocking a DPF. After 150,000 miles, the blockage can rise to almost 80% ash, and finally the filter will block and the engine will stop working. This is a fully blocked DPF. The level of certain ash in the filter blades means it can no longer function. After it is removed from the vehicle, one end of the filter is sealed with a bung. Detergent is poured into the filter, which is left to stand for 20 minutes. The bung is then removed and the detergent is drained. The filter is now ready to be attached to the DCS-16. The DCS-16 is designed to easily and safely connect to a full range of DPF models. Featuring a 5 to 6 bar 220 volt compressor and an option of either manual or automatic timer relay operation. The workbed features tough straps and extensions and these are provided for a very stable optimum fit no matter the DPF you are cleaning. The control panel includes a pressure gauge and a dual timer control to set the regularity and duration of the pressure release when the machine is run on automatic mode. The DPF adapter is connected to the intake on the DPF and clamped to the pipe for an airtight seal. Water is mixed with the compressed air and shot through the filter to remove any blockages and clean the entire filter of impurities. Following the detergent treatment, the DPF is securely strapped down to the work bed. The workbed is fully adjustable to fit any shape of DPF and hold it in place during the cleaning. The rubber adapter is clamped into place providing an airtight seal. This too is designed to fit any DPF inlet. Ten to eleven litres of water is fed gradually from a pressurised container to mix with the air from the compressor. Now with everything set up, the system pressure is checked and the water valve released. Manual blast is set to check the system is sealed and then the cleaning commences. Immediate results can be seen, as all the certain ash is forced out of the DPF. <laughs> the machine is run for a further 5 to 10 minutes, until all the impurities are being cleared from the filter, and the DPF is pretty much as good as new. This is a DPF following the 20 minute soak with the detergent. We attempt to run water through the filter, but it is completely blocked. Following a session on the DCS-16, water now flows free and clear through the DPF. <laughs> 